Upon the land of Issa, the sun sets for bed. Its gold and crimson rays gazes through the dense forest of Ebe. As the last ray exits the horizon, the new source of light is now from the crescent moon in the sky. Suddenly, a loud noise echoes through the forest. The source is revealed to be two men engaged in battle, surrounded by rubble and dust. One runs and the other pursues in a trail of dust. The chase continues until the fleer spots the bridge ahead. He is relieved to behold this sight. However, the elation is caught short by the pursuant with despair. Now the celebration belongs to the other as he revels in the success of the mission to prevent the enemy from crossing the bridge. His eyes deceive him. The spear has pierced a mold of clay instead of the body of his opponent. This reveal brings a smirk to his face. He blamed himself for belittling the skills of a calabash of clay. They are skilled in the art of deception. Across the bridge, he locks eyes with his opponent and they stare at each other. With no words spoken, both accept the battle is done for the night, but the encounter has certainly provoked a cascade of future events. They disappear into the moonlit night.